Sweet, sweet Sadie J coming back at you. I am over here in my little Dollar Tree over by Walmart, some Cooper Road. And they have these cute little signs. <clears throat> Joy to the world. These I think are five dollars. Yep, five dollars. But they are so cute. Look at the way they're made. They got this whole U boat full of Christmas stuff. Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. It is a Saturday, so it's probably going to be loud up in here. Well, Lisa got the music down low. I guess everybody got the same memo to put out that stuff. Let's see what we got over here. Ooh, look at these. Merry and bright in the buffalo check. That would match my rose and my mat. They got the happy holiday and the towel. And they finally did get these um, towels to match the pot holders and the oven mitt that I showed you. They are so cute. They got the gnomes. They got Tis the Seasons with the Christmas. And I showed you guys these before. All right, let's keep looking and see what else they have. Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. Welcome back to my channel, Sweet Sadie J TV. I am finally, finally getting a moment, you guys, to sit down and relaxingly show you guys a haul. <laughs> but it's just one day because tomorrow I have to go and help set set the polls up for election day on Tuesday. And Tuesday, as you know, I will be there all day. Ugh. But anywho, let's um let me show you a few things that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. It's not a really big haul today, but I did go to Walmart's first before I went to the Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna show you it's just like three items. I'm gonna show you a few items that I have that I got from Walmart's. I also have a pile of friend mail sitting over there again after I just got through the other load. <laughs> but thank you all who think of me and keep me in your prayers at all times. I love you guys, but y'all know with me working the polls, I have not had a chance to open um, the packages. I got something from my girl Donna, from Donna Dills and more Dollar Tree Halls. Oh shoot, I always mess up her her channel name. I think it's Donna Dills and more. I got something from Rosie Nebrega. I got something else from Marina and I got something from my girl, Lisa Dukes, but that's another whole video. Okay. You guys, let's jump into this haul. Okay. My sweets, I had to put the specs on because I have not been able to see this small writing, but these are just a few items that I picked up from um, Walmart's before I went to the Dollar Tree because once I left the Dollar Tree, I just wanted to go home. But this is something that I swear by. I take these all the time. Um, this is called Highlands Naturals Leg Cramps. These are the PM Fast and Effective. Number one pharmacist recommended. They're 50 quick dissolving tablets, homeopathic. Now they do have the daytime ones, but they're not the dissolving tablets. They are just the pills. But these are what I take because... I don't suffer from leg cramps most of the time until after I lay down and go to sleep. So this is what they look like. They used to be nine something at Walmart's, but like everything else, the price has increased to 10 something. So now it's like 11, $12 for a box. You get 50 tabs. You can take as many as you want. I typically, before I go to bed, will take three under my tongue and let them dissolve. And usually I can get a good night's sleep without my legs cramping from standing on them too long, you know, um, or walking long distance, like walking Walmarts. But yeah, these are really, really good and I love them. So I got those and I've been on the hunt for it's time to wash the hair again and I want to rebraid it back up. And I've been really, really searching for a decent 
yet affordable shampoo and conditioner moisturizing shampoo and conditioner I've been using the oh my goodness it kind of looks like the dupe for the um, with the bumblebee hive on it I've used that the last couple of times and it's been okay but it doesn't specifically say moisturizing so my mom used to swear by this and I think when my sister had her hair cut short, she used to use it, but this is not the activator. This is actually Hawaiian Silky 14-in-1 Miracle Worker Shampoo. And I got the shampoo and the conditioner, and they were actually reasonably priced at Walmarts. They were like four something, four ninety seven, so five dollars a bottle. You get a sixteen fluid ounce. This, the shampoo says gently cleanses, moisturizes, detangles, smooths and seals, defines curls, strengthens, provides slip, adds shine, softens, refreshes hair and scalp, prevents breakage, soothes scalp, promotes healthy hair and scalp for natural and relaxed hair, makes scalp feel good. So I think Hawaiian Silky is a really, really good product. And I really gonna I'm gonna try it and hope that you know it'll work for me and it smells so good y'all woohoo mm -mm -mm. it smells really good if it if I like it I'm gonna go back and get some more for my sister because we both had problems when we took our braids out trying to use um, trying to get our hair from being mangled my sister's hair was literally mangled she literally had to cut some of her hair out and me being tender-headed man I was almost in tears just trying to comb my own hair out from using um, the PS products from the Dollar Tree mm -mm, they did not work for us at all but this is the conditioner and the conditioner basically says the same thing and it's the same size bottle and this smells even better than the shampoo so yeah I'm gonna Mm, I'm really gonna try it and I hope and pray that I don't be in tears trying to comb through my own hair after I wash and, and you know after I wash it so those are the three items that I got from Walmart and we're gonna jump right into this Dollar Tree haul okay my sweet. Right. I saw like three of these at um, the Dollar Tree the other the last time I went to it and I grabbed them because I really really like this product this is, it says new, but it's not new anymore. This is the Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula with Vitamin E. It says raw coconut oil, cacao, nucifera. I don't know what that is, but anyway. Zero break pre-shampoo works on hair before shampoo with macadamia, avocado, and argan oils, and mango butter. I love this. This stuff is great. So I use this right before I shampoo. Sometimes I'll put it in my hair first thing in the morning. I'll walk around the whole day with this in my hair and then later on get in the shower and wash my hair. I really, really like it. And for $1.25, I think it's a fabulous um, opportunity to get it because I don't know how much it is like in Walmarts or anywhere. But as always, it says no this, no that, no build up. But yeah, I really, really like it. I used to... Um, what did they call it? I can't even think of the name where you put a whole lot of conditioner in your hair before you washed it and pre-poo or something like that. But this is great. So yeah, I got that. And let me sit that over there so it doesn't break anything. And I was telling you guys before the last haul that I made, I think I found the new polish at the Dollar Tree. It's called um, CV Color Vibes. And I knew that I had seen on someone else's haul or walk through or browse through me where they had the CV wrap it dry. So I went to the small Dollar Tree the other day when I got off from the polls and I found it. This was, they didn't have it at the large Dollar Tree. They only had the base coat and the top coat. But I did find the Color Vibe um, Rapid Dry Coat, which is what I'm wearing right now. The only thing I have to say about the polish itself is that I used the black and a little accent blue, which I hauled already. And the thing about this polish is that it's really, really pretty when you're putting it on and it's very shiny. But as soon as it dries, it dries down really dull. Looks like you, your nails have been polished for like a week or more. And without the top coat, this is the only way I got the little, the little, um, you know, glossy look. Because if I hadn't put on the rapid dry top coat, 
yeah, they would look so dull and so dry. It would look like my nails had been polished like a week or two ago. So that's so far my experience with the Color Vibe um, colors, but I had already bought more colors before I used this, so I didn't really know. But I did go ahead and pick up this one from the Small Dollar Tree. This one is called Snatch, and I thought it was really, really pretty. And it is the Color Vibe. It looks really, really pretty, but I'm going to try it and see if it does the same thing because these are the two that I used that I hauled before the black, and I was looking forward to that black. I don't know why I was just filling in a black mode <laughs> for my nails as they grow back, and then that blue. So then I found this one. This is like a royal blue, and it's called Deep uh, deep Dive, and this is really, really pretty. It's really pretty in the in the bottles, but I hope that not all of them, once you put them on, are not drying. Once they dry, they look so dull and ashy kind of like. But I bought this one. Y'all know I don't like glitter polish. I hate, I like it, but I hate trying to take it off. But I bought this for someone for a thank you um, as part of her thank you gift. This is called um, Glitterific, and she loves glitter. So she'll probably know who she is. But I saw this one, and I didn't see her haul this on her channel. So I'm hoping she hasn't found it yet. Cause it looks just like her. <laughs> so I got this for her, but, um, yeah, I like glitter polish, but I don't like glitter polish. Y'all know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay Moving right along. I found this big bag of charms, fluffy stuff, snowballs, cotton candy. This is strawberry flavored. It says it's artificially flavored. It's a fat free candy, sodium free, cholesterol free, and the expiration of Best Buy is, hmm, I'm not seeing. I should have looked for it earlier, but it's probably imprinted in the bag somewhere. Even with my glasses on, I can't see it. But I know it's it has to be okay because it just came out with all the Christmas stuff. But then again, that don't mean anything because it could have been from last year. But I don't remember seeing this bag last year. This is the Charms Fluffy Stuff snowball and this is a big bag like the other one i showed you guys this is huge it's full right up into the top so i'm not sure oh there it is i just put my finger on it this is best buy um february of 2024 so you got to 2024 to eat that which i know i usually don't eat this stuff i just pass it over so i saw that and it looks really interesting. Snowballs. And it's strawberry. Strawberry, y'all. Strawberry flavor. I love anything strawberry. So I got that. Let me put that over there. And then I watch, um, if you watch Gail Patricia Moore, uh, Gail Dollar Tree Halls and more, I love her channel. We always support each other. And I wish I could support everybody, but... I'm always watching her channel, and she's been recently showing these Wiley Wallaby Soft and Chewy um, Liquish. It's fat-free, no high-fructose corn syrup, vegan. This one that I found in my local Dollar Tree, in the large one, this was Classic Red Natural Strawberry Flavored Liquish. And it says, Taste the Wiley Difference. Real soft, real chewy, and real delicious. And it's a five-ounce bag. Well, it was a five-ounce bag because I've eaten almost half of it, okay? <laughs> it looks like this. It is so delicious, you guys. If you like licorice, and I love me cherry and strawberry licorice, especially strawberry. I told you I love anything strawberry. Well, most. <laughs> they look like this. They're kind of thick and gooey and chewy and soft. Oh, my God. And the flavor, the flavor is like, I couldn't stop eating them. I just wanted to try one of them after I had my dinner. And I just, like, almost half the bag. And it came in a nice size bag from the Dollar Tree. I definitely will be looking for more of these. She showed them in all kinds of different flavors um, grape or blackberry or something, but I hope I will find them. But my store only had this one. And I said, well, you know, 
Um, Gail is always showing these on her channel. Why not try it? Oh my goodness. These don't expire until August 17th of 2023. And this is what they look like. Again, if you see these in your stores, try them. If you like liquids, they are delicious. She was right. They are absolutely, absolutely delicious. I had a hard time stopping eating those, y'all. So, moving right along, I was at the small Dollar Tree and... I was up at the register and I saw these new, this is called Paradise Platinum Series. Oh, I think that's in the wrong language. Okay. Yeah. This is called Paradise Platinum Series Premium Organic Air Fresheners. And they're like the little ones that I showed you, I hauled on my channel, like the cherry and the new car smell. Well, these are a different brand. These are made in the USA. This is a cranberry um, smell. They had three different ones. One was cranberry, one was vanilla, and one was new car smell. I chose the cranberry. They look like this. And I've never seen these before. We've seen the other ones, and I really like them. I still have the cherry one in my car right now. And then I have a new car of the ones that the Dollar Tree regularly shows or carries. But I had never seen these before. But I said, you know what? I want to try this and cranberry. Yeah, who doesn't like cranberry? So it looks like this. Hope oh, my phone will focus. Isn't that nice? And you take this off right here. It does say um, scratch and sniff, 33% more fragrance oil. So it looks like that. So I said, hmm, what is that? Let me try it, okay? So I can smell it. Ooh, mm-hmm. I can smell it without even um, scratching and sniffing. Oh, wow. It smells really good. So I said, okay, I'll try one. Now, I would have gotten the vanilla one, and I typically like the um, smell of vanilla, but sometimes it'll give me a headache. So I chose the cranberry out of the three. I said, if I like it, I'll go back and I'll get some more. Okay, guys. So okay, my on. sweets. I picked up um, two packs of these E-Circuit um, C batteries. I haven't had to buy C batteries, and I don't know when, y'all, but I'm going to show you in, uh, at the end of this video, what I needed these batteries for. Um, these are, like I showed you before, best before February 2025. You only get two of the C batteries per pack, but what I'm using them for, you actually need three. So I've already put um, the three in there, but $1.25 for E-Circuit, low draining battery, long shelf life batteries, right up my alley. Yes, please. Yes, please. Then I found these, um, basket bags and there's two packs and I'm not sure if I should have gotten more because these are specifically for my sister's gifts, my, um, sister Lena and my sister Nettie. And so I just got two for now. Hmm. I might go back and get some more, but anyway, I just thought these were so cute. These are basket bags. And I love to make their little Christmas baskets and then put them in these bags. And of course, they do come with the twist ties or you can use rubber bands or whatever you want. But they do come with the twist ties. So I just thought that was so festive and so pretty. And when I saw these, this was only the only pattern that I saw at the moment. So yeah, I just grabbed one. You do get a two pack. So I love to make up their baskets, you know, and cover them in those. And I'm so heartbroken, you guys, over not trying that Jim Bean um, vanilla bourbon coffee before my store ran out. I mean, my store put them out twice. And I looked at him and looked at him and said, eh, I haven't even tried them yet. And I finally tried that coffee. I had to go to Rocky Mount to get my percolator from my sister because, y'all know, I have a curate. <sighs> that coffee was so good, y'all. And of course, I went back looking for more and I can't find it anywhere. But I did find some more of the Junior's most famous, most fabulous Brooklyn blend. And I got another bag of that because it was good. It was very, this is very good coffee. It's just not as good as the bourbon vanilla. Even the original bourbon um, coffee wasn't as good as that bourbon vanilla. That had some type of taste to it. 
and it was just absolutely fabulous. But this is next in line, and this was what I was able to find. And again, it's a four ounce bag. I get maybe maybe three pots of coffee at ten cups out of this bag, so that's not bad. And the Best Buy is 7-27-2023. So you got into July 23rd, which that'll be gone by then because I, my Keurig hasn't been on in days because I've been using my percolator. And the next item is, I showed you guys these before, and everyone that I've watched so far, all of us did the same thing. We wanted to say Hamburger Helper, but it's not Hamburger Helper. It's just Helper. I found another different kind of the Helper Mac and Cheese, and I know there's three out there because I've seen them on somebody's walkthrough or, or haul. I'm not sure who it was, but anywho, I know there's a, a like a jalapeno one out there, but I'm not really interested in that one anyway. So, but anywho, I digress. This is the mac, the helper mac and cheese. Now with more cheese, but this is the bold cheesy pizza. And instead of with the macaroni shells, this is with. This looks like it's with shells, but I think it's macaroni. Yeah, I think this is macaroni. It's a 2.6 ounce of mac and cheese, bold, cheesy pizza, and you microwave it for three, three minutes and 30, um, yeah, three minutes and 30 seconds, and it looks just like the other one, but only it's the bold, cheesy pizza. So again, I just got two, because I guess my store is just putting them out one at a time. <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, I saw the new flavor, and I got two of these, as always, one for me and one for my sister. So we're going to try it out. Oh, the Best Buy is April two, April 15th, 2023. So it says Best Buy. Okay. So we got those. And then my store had the Domino's um, Premium Cane Powdered Sugar. And I was surprised to see this. I have not seen this at the Dollar Tree. And, and a name brand, too. I was like, what? This is Best Buy, July 26, 2024. And, wow, I have a whole bag of Food Lion brand powdered sugar in there. But, honey, you need powdered sugar during baking time. So, I thought that was a great deal. So, I purchased one of those. And then we're going to get down to... <sighs> okay, my sweets. Before I forget, I want to show you the only um, wrapping paper I found so far that I really, really wanted, and I don't know how I'm going to use this. I want to specifically or specially wrap the children's gifts in this wrapping paper that I'm donating to the churches and to the orphanage. But this is the Barbie gift wrap. It's 25 square feet. I could not believe how beautiful this wrapping paper is. I'm like, can y'all see that? And they have the stockings, they have the girls on here. I mean, they're, they are just so cute. I could not help it, y'all. I had to have this paper. I'm trying to show you guys all the little different images on here of the Barbies. And I was like, oh yes, you're coming home with me. I have to have you. Even if I have to wrap one of my gifts in this wrapping paper and put it under the tree, I will do it. But I had to show you it before I forgot, okay? And the next few items is some books that I found at My Large Dollar Tree that I just love, love, love. And I will be sending most of these out in friend mail because I have some very special friends that I think would really love these books. This is called um, Queens of the Resistance. This is Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez. She is a politician. She's very brass, but she's very, very talented, and I really do admire her. Oh, poo-poo, y'all. I forgot. Okay, there we go. I thought I was going to have to take that sticker off. In the U.S., it retails for $18, and in Canada, it retails for $24. And these are the authors that wrote the book. That is um, Brenda Jones and Chris Christian... Trotman, so you can see that, but everybody knows her. She's really, really, I'm real. I really admire her for her courage and the way she. I could not believe that they had this in the Dollar Tree, and they do have a few little interest um, pictures in here. Queens know how to have fun. Looks like that, 
And so I purchased these as gifts for people, for certain uh, few people that I know and love. And let me see if I can find some more pictures. Queen, well-behaved women rarely make history. So yeah, I thought it would be really, really interested, interesting, excuse me. And so I did pick up four. I got four of these because like I said, I plan to send them out in friend mail to, I couldn't buy more. <laughs> I think I got all that they had, the four that they had. So I got four of those to send out in friend mail. Whew, yeah, mm -hmm. lots and lots of friend mail, y'all. <laughs> so I'm going to put these back in the bag. Ugh. And then I needed some more um, toilet bowl cleaner. So I got the works again. I really, really like this. It does very well for me. I have no problems with it whatsoever. And it's really big for $1.25. It lasts me a nice amount of time before I have to go back out and get another one. And it's just called the Works Classic Clean Toilet Bowl Cleaner. Cleans and deodorizes the toughest toilet bowl stains. And it's um, 24 fluid ounce. So it's really nice. It's got the little spout where you can get up underneath, you know. Y'all know. Ugh. Yeah, I hate cleaning the toilet. <laughs> but I love this for $1.25. I love it even more. So I got that. And then a few little Christmas items. That I'm going to show you and then I'll get to the thumbnail because I was so excited to find what y'all saw in the thumbnail. But I saw these little cute little luminescence light up um, LED light up angels flickering effect on and off switch. I did not even know they lit up when I purchased it. I just saw the angel and I'm always thinking, oh my God, angels are so beautiful. They watch over you. And I got it home and I started twiddly dinking around with it. I pulled the tab, make sure when you purchase these things like this, that you always make sure the tab is put, is still in there. But when I pulled the tab on this baby, y'all, and I, turn at, I turned her on, I was like, oh my God, what in the world? <laughs> She changes colors. I was like, ah! Now, y'all know. I'm a big kid. I like anything that lights up. Is this not beautiful, you guys? Oh, my Lord. So, one of these angels will definitely be in my 6K giveaway. I'm I'm packing y'all stuff up. I'm telling you. Look at that purple. Look, look. I was just like so thrilled. I was like, oh my God. She lights up. She has the prayer hands. Can y'all see that? She's in the pink. She is just absolutely divine. I was like, what? So I got so excited about this one that I rushed back to the Dollar Tree and I bought nine more. <laughs> I bought nine more. I don't know how I'm going to distribute these. I, of course, want my two sisters to have one. So that's going to leave seven. And out of those seven, one's going in the giveaway. So that's going to leave <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. That's going to leave six beautiful light up LED. And believe me, I pulled every one of these out. It has a little piece of styrofoam in there to keep them snug. I bought it just like this. But I pulled each and every one of them out to make sure that their tabs were still, you know, in there. This one's slightly, slightly out. But, yeah, I did check each and every one of them to make sure that their tabs were still in place. So, yeah, I will be distributing those accordingly. I was very, very careful with their wings, you know, because they're so very fragile. So, yeah. I just loved it, y'all. Y'all know how I am with the light-up stuff. Anything that lights up, I'm there. I'm there. That's all I can say. Oh, one of the tags just came off. But anyway, we're going to be on the last few items. Okay, my sweets. The reason why I needed those C batteries was to put into this. Now, when my store first turned over to Dollar Tree Plus, they had these, and I admired them, and I stood there, and I stared at them, and I said, you know, I would love to have one of these, you know, as part of my, not just my Christmas decoration, because I believe you could use this all year long during the winter anyway, 
And then I was watching one of Marina's from Confessions of a Dollar Tree Hall. I was watching one of her hauls while she was still sick and she was still filming and everything. And she had one behind her that she had purchased years ago from somewhere. I don't even remember where she said she got it from. But I had just seen these in the Dollar Tree. And I really wanted to get one, but for some reason, I didn't get it that day. So when I finally decided I wanted to pull the trigger, which was after I saw it in Marina's video, Yes, I said that. Then I really was convinced that I wanted one. And I went back to get it, and they were completely sold out. Oh, Lord, thank you once again. They restocked. And my friend Paul, he told me they had lots of them in the back. So I purchased this fireplace. I know you guys can see the phone and stuff. But this is like a mock fireplace. It does require 3C batteries. But when you put it on, it looks like this. Oh my God. Can y'all see this? All right, let's just cover this up so y'all can see this. And it makes the noise. You can hear it. Can you hear the noise? Oh my God. Is that not beautiful? Look at that. I know I got the football game on. For $5, you guys, you can't beat this. And everybody is buying them up. And I could not believe they restocked and he said he had more in the back to put out when those sold out. These are one of the first items in the Dollar Tree Plus aisle that sold completely out. These and like the um, the big, you know, um, tags, um, steaks, whatever they are. Though these fireplaces and those were the first two things that sold out in the Dollar Tree Plus. But I thought this was a great buy for five dollars and look at it it looks so real and marina was the one that made me do it be well actually i wanted one at first but when i saw it in her background it just confirmed i gotta have one of these so that's what i purchased the c batteries for i just think it is the most beautiful thing i've ever seen it's called christmas flame lan lantern and of course it has the little measurements and stuff on it but look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? I think this is more, I think this is worth more than $5. So I got this and I absolutely am in love with it. And in some of them were differently made. So when you look at them in the store, you have to make sure you get the red part because some of them just had like all black, you know, but I wanted that flame. I wanted to, to see, I wanted you to see that flame in it. And I don't know where it's going, honey, but it's going up there somewhere. Okay, the last of this haul is what you guys saw in the thumbnail. And I don't know where they pulled these out from, but honey, they re, re, um, restocked the in-wash aroma boosters, the big ones. And they look like they have been sitting back there in the stock room for some time. But they don't have an expiration date on them or anything. So I purchased two of them for right now. These are the 17.5 ounce. Um, ones and I do open them before I buy them to see are they the small beads or are they the large chips and these were the small multicolor beads which is the way I like them and if I hadn't made it to the Dollar Tree today I would have gotten two more because I'm going to keep on buying them until I stock up again unless they sell out on me. But this is a great buy and all the other ones that I got, I'm just going to give them away to the church or to my friends, whoever wants them, because these are what I love the most. It's just in-wash aroma boosters and odor eliminator. And I don't know, let me see, let me see, scent-based fragrance um, distributed by XPG Company. I don't know who that is, but yeah, y'all know we had these before and they stopped carrying them. You know, they went away like a lot of stuff at the Dollar Tree, but when they come back out, you need to grab them, but make sure you open them and see which ones they are because those chips are hard to dissolve in your laundry. And if you're doing towels or linens, they'll get like all caught up in your towels and stuff. So you want the little small beads, which is just like downy. But that is it, you guys. That is it for my small little Dollar Tree haul and a few little items from Walmart. I'm so happy to almost almost be back to normal. I spent the whole day cleaning my house today. That's why I did not get to go to the Dollar Tree. 
and I was just informed today that they need me to come tomorrow and help set up. And then we got to be there Tuesday morning at 5.30 in the morning. So, yeah. After that, it's going to be over with. I'll be back to normal. I can upload on a regular basis. And I can interact with my beautiful, wonderful sweets. So, thank you all so much for watching. Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And everyone, have a blessed day. Bye, guys.